Invision My Idol wow. no! Hi, I'm Haman Bashir. I'm a student at Spring Valley High School. I'm from Sri Lanka. And our concept of ideal world is how students come from different countries and interact here in Spring Valley High School. the ideal world is a place governed by peace and love with good and peaceful people a world where children shouldn't be afraid to walk alone in the street a place where no one would suffer from hunger and violence hi i envision the ideal world like a place where everyone is treated and educated equally with all differences between rich and poor people in my vision an ideal world is a place where all that matters is the happiness and the welfare of people in my ideal world, all people should be born with hope. There would be no wars or discriminations between people and everybody would speak one language living in the same community. There would be no differences between poor and rich people or between sick and healthy people. People should be caring and tolerant with one another and live together in harmony. The world is as it is because of us. We have the power to change it. I think that the ideal world is where the people are good, where they take care of each other and they are always helpful. In an ideal world, this needs more love, respect, caring and finally a good soul. People must be tolerant and friendly. The change you want to see in the world begins with you. I choose to change, but you? Back to India, 
Kablan Nehul Public School. Let's view their clips. Hi, this is Avneet Kaur from Kamla Nehru Public School, Fagwara. I am going to share my views on my ideal world. In my ideal world, people are responsible and caring. They care for planet Earth. They will plant at least one tree on his or her birthday. There will be no hunger, no poverty and no gender discrimination. There will be a feeling of brotherhood amongst the people. People will be having quality education. Thank you. The world that I see, the world that glitters my eyes is my own. A very good morning to all my respectable senior and junior citizens. Today, Aladisha from 9 Division want to share my version of you on my world. Like the ocean spread all over wide, humanity, peace should be spread like the ocean. We should have literacy, prosperity in our society. By this, may the next generation be the contentment. The first is the education which is the right of every citizen to get literate. It is above all caste, religion, sex, color, and class. We should have literate citizens in our country. It is the birthright of every child to be literate. Whereas the technology improves the world, it may made the world heaven or the hell. Technology should be betterment for the society, not the destruction, for the unmatchable creation of God that is Earth. It is a time where the, where the travel became so easy as coming to school in my kind of world. It can do what nothing can be, nobody can do about it. Then, the main ingredient of my world should be the respect of humanity, which is the main deal with every people of the life in my world. If we do respect, we should respect others also. So, this is my world that I want to be. This world may be deserve corruption, may be deserve peace and humanity, and may release corruption. This is my world, my earth. My earth, we made for earth, we made of the earth, and made by the earth. Thank you. Dreams are not those which you see while sleeping. Dreams are those which don't let you speak. To get equality and justice are the dreams of everyone, even my dream too. My dream world is a world where no matter poor or rich should get a justice because justice is very important for all. No matter how rich or poor we are, we should get a right to study because it is our right to study because we have the right to prove ourselves. Look around the world full of pollution, inequality, justice, inequality, injustice. I want a world where all these things should be removed. Our nation, our nation is full of crime. Can we remove this crime? Yes, this crime can be removed. Only with the hard work and sensation. And this hard work and sensation comes from ourselves. This sensation can only be helpful in making our dream come true. For me, ideal world is one where man and woman will be equally treated and protected where no discrimination will be there on the basis of caste, creed, religion, etc. where all human beings will be taken care of. Thank you. Uh, now we are back to Indonesia. Welcome back from India. Indonesia is also a nice country like India and dual primary school with magnificent children that also have put their uh, presentations of the IAN project. Uh, now we have Come back to Indonesia. We are going to see more project, more videos in Indonesia. They are really nice, and when they know, they try to view and put more action in what they want to show and what they want to communicate to you. Enjoy. I want to take a word around the word for me because I love adventure. My name is Pedia Pedia. It is huh? war in free from because online game can make uh, it be lazy to learn in school. Hello everybody, my name is Chika Alfianisti. I want to go around the world with no charge. But whatever I want to buy without thinking the price if I don't have any money. Hello, my name is Arbuji Rohyani. I would like Indonesia snow and spring. Because patients are want to find the chill of the snow 
and I would like to see the beautiful last trees. Hello, my name is Etzel Yesua. I, I am from Indonesia. I want to tell you my dearest word. My dearest word is where the town where I live, I dream of the snowfall, colder, and around my town. And all kids very happy. They can feel the softness and of the snow. And the cold they can play with the snow as well. I bore it with hot my climber in town. I think what make the earth is getting hotter here is land burning for opening a foggy area. In is this wash are born upon oil plantations. Oh, one that we can be in the video is have a bully. What we want it really happen. I want to have a serious house in the middle of the jungle because I want to. To invite people to build a place to stay with no damage to forest. I want to create something new because I want to see a lot of people. Because I want to a successful people. My name is Benny Nautrisna. My name is Ahmad Juliandi. My name is Triandi. My name is Ferdi Kurniawan. In vision, my ideal world. <laughs> I want every cars, truck, and motorcycle do not use fossil fuel as their gas. I hate pollution caused by the vehicle, and I also concur with the heat price of the fossil fuel. Maybe sometime, sometimes I cannot afford it anymore. In the future, my ideal is when every vessel uses water as their gas. I wish, I wish there is no pollution, and it may be affordable fuel. Thank you. Look, jangan dulu. I want to my ideal world is free from poverty. Why? Because we know that our people around the world like how is spoiled by fertility, spoiled heat carrier, and modern technology. But do we realize that there are many people who cannot enjoy the benefit? 
of technology because it is costly. It is almost even for double. Welcome back from Uganda, Indonesia, so many countries. Now we are back to Australia. I love Australia. Now let us look at some of the videos that the students of Blackburn High School made. Take a look at the videos. <laughs> My ideal world. I can live in a small wooden house. I can play with birds freely. I can grow dandelions. I can smell beautiful flowers. I can fly free and see higher world. I can play plants. I can sleep on the grass comfortably. It's like a childhood dream and nature's always here. That is my ideal world. Hi! I'm Alyssa. I'm Kara. I'm Megan. And I'm Sarah. And our ideal world consists of no judgment. It doesn't matter what race or sexuality you are, whether you're gay, straight, black or white, your skin colour or your sexuality doesn't matter when we're all the same inside. Instead of bullying and judging someone for who they are, embrace it. Accept that people are different in their own special way. Bullying someone won't make you We're all human, so why waste our days judging each other when we could all get along and be friends? If you see someone upset and alone, introduce yourself and start a conversation instead of ignoring them and walking away. We all have the power to change the world, so let's do it in a positive way. The simple small way can make some mistakes. This is our ideal world. Thanks for watching. Where women and men get paid equally and all have the same opportunities and rights. Racism will be eliminated and everyone would accept people for who they are and what they believe in. In this world, everyone would have access to clean water and fresh food every day. And an education. Everybody would have shelter and basic amenities and medical care would be easily available to everyone. In our ideal world, global warming wouldn't be an issue. We would use clean energy to prevent pollution. There will be no deforestation or destruction of habitat. And there would be no loss of biodiversity. This is our ideal world and we hope we can make it a reality. Hello, 
in my ideal world, all the people who are homeless shouldn't be homeless and should be wealthy. That's my ideal world. All of this. In my ideal world, people would do more about global warming, such as stopping pollution and um, waste into the ocean. That would be my ideal world. In my ideal world, there wouldn't be any poverty. People would have places to live and everyone would not be low on food. That is my ideal world. In my ideal world, I want everyone to be equal. So no one's poor and no one's rich. Everyone lives in houses and yeah, everyone has money. Dun, 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 world hunger. It's growing. A problem. A scarcity of food in a country, and it's a growing problem. And we have all the facts pointing to it. <laughs> the World Food Program calculates that 3.2 billion US dollars are needed each per year to reach all 66 million hungry school aged One quarter children. of people in the urban environment are undernourished. Recently, there has been a big push for urban farming. Urban farming empowers families gain control over their own food source. There are 850 million people in the world do not eat enough to be healthy. That means that one in every eight people on earth goes to Every year, hungry. Australia produces enough food to feed 60 million people, yet 2 million people still rely on food services. Poor nutrition causes nearly 45% of death in children under 5. One out of six people, roughly 100 million people, in developing countries are underweight. <laughs> Hi, my name is Ryan. Hi, my name is Chris. My name's Ringo. Okay. And, and this, this is our ideal world. world. World is my ideal world is one where everybody, no matter their economic status, has access to good quality education. My ideal world is a place where there's no discrimination and the freedom of doing anything without being judged. My ideal world is a world rid of physical and mental abuse. My ideal world is with a world without conflict. If all conflict can't be eliminated, bullying would be second on my list. Go. Secondly, health and hygiene. I would like to see everyone have access to clean water, hygiene needs and sanitation, and also medical resources, for this all will lead to a healthier lifestyle for everyone. Thirdly, clean environment. In my ideal world, the world is not polluted and there is no global warming. This is our world and we have our responsibility to keep it clean and healthy. Should have. Fair income should also be given to workers. Everyone
Many people have the same ideal world, which is a world with gender equality, race equality, sufficient resources and no war. This is slightly unrealistic, so we decided to make an ideal world which is achievable in the present. Sufficient education. Our group believes that every child should have the right to an education. More than 100 million children don't have an education. That's nearly five times the population of Australia. This is due to the rising price of schools. We think that government education should be, should be for free, or at least affordable for all people. Sustainable environment. The pollution of the earth is one of the most threatening problems humanity will ever have to face, with 8 million metric tonnes of waste being dumped into the ocean each year, and over 1 million seabirds and 100,000 marine mammals being killed every year by overpollution, and pollution affecting the health of over 100 million people every year. It's a serious problem. But fortunately, companies like Greenpeace are working towards a sustainable solution by implementing wildlife sanctuaries, green energy sources, and encouraging people to do more recycling. Affordable medicine. As humans, we all deserve to be able to afford the right treatments and healthcare for us and our family. In the US, the world's largest economy, 50,000 people a year die because they cannot afford the correct healthcare. Considering the massive amount of money the government consistently has available to budget, this is unacceptable. Many of the, many of the infections and, in, and infectious diseases that ravage third world countries are very easily treatable. The leading first world nation needs to provide more support to make this care much more accessible. Also, with the prominence of sexually transmitted infections in these countries, sufficient sexual protection needs to be widely available. If you've been to the city, you see people all over the place surviving on the kindness of others. However, these unfortunate souls account for only 2% of hungry people all over the world. The crazy thing is, the world actually produces enough food to feed all 7 billion people. However, 11% of the world's population either don't have the money or the accessibility. Of course, one of the solutions would be just to not waste so much food. However, with the population growing so fast, something like this just wouldn't be solved overnight. Hi, welcome back. We've gone to so many countries, Africa, Europe, and now we're back to Asia, in that very country, Pakistan. There is another school and the only primary school that took part in this project. And this school is none other than Dale Primary School. Let's watch their video. My ideal world is tourism free. Everyone love each other, help each other and remain happy together by accepting differences. People will know importance of everyone's lives. Everyone will be busy in their job and live happy life. No one will fight each other. People will have good education and maintain manner. No one will harm anyone. There will be no bomb blast and bloodshed when there will be no accidental strikes so we will not face any economical loss. Citizens will fulfill their duties and take care of their responsibilities. Rules and regulations will be followed by everyone. All children will get good education. We will get progress. There will be peace in our world. My ideal world will be free from pollution, diseases and everyone will be happy, healthy and get good food in healthy environment. I want to be a chemist. I want to make chemicals to reduce the pollution. You know that our environment is polluted because ozone layer ha has got damaged and also got holes on it. It causes many diseases and harmful rays. I will make those chemicals which can reduce the pollution, repair the ozone layer, is strong to grow when plants will grow bold. They will provide fresh air and oxygen as well. Plants are very helpful for us. It cleans the air. It will rain more in our area and temperature become pleasant. We will be free from diseases and get plenty of food by rain. Harmful rays will not attack our world and we will be safe. There are two types of people in the world. One, who are the donters. 
the don'ters think a lot, but they don't do anything about it. For example, they think that they have to become an engineer when they grow up, but they don't do anything about it. They just don't do. They just think a lot. I know you study, you get tired, but they quit. They give up. I mean, they are afraid to fail. They and then they do the things from which they get pleasure and waste their time. And then some people come and tell them that they are doing wrong. That that's not the right time to seek pleasure. But the don'ters think that whatever the other person is telling them is all wrong but I'm really sorry this is how not how you won't be successful this is not how you'll be able to live your dream I'm sorry you'll you'll remain a loser if you continue on this path and the other type is a doer There is no restriction on what God can do is a willing help. Everyone wants freedom. No one wants to have restrictions. No restrictions, only free. Using WhatsApp. We all want to use, use WhatsApp and every day, every night, every time. As you can see, it is a boy and he is using WhatsApp on daily use. No exam. Everyone wants no exams. There shouldn't be any test or exams. We don't have to give exams and there should be no restrictions. Family outings. Family outings with cousins, family members, siblings and mother and father. People enjoy them with their relatives, with their friends. every time he wants to that he should be using whatsapp every time no time limits and no restrictions no studies in all schools we all should study but in today's generation no one wants to study and no one wants to go to schools
in the front. Uganda. The second school that participated in Envision My Audio World project is Ruboni SS. Let's watch the videos. I want a world of peace, justice, and empl employment for the youths. My ideal world is a world that flows milk and honey, a world that there is love, compassion, joy, and sharing for each other. And I would like it to be in peace and religious way of living. I want to live in the world which has got a one world program where there is one religion, one culture, one president, and one official language. I want to live in a world of clean environments where people will be free from diseases like HIV, cholera, STDs, and so on. My ideal world is to live in a corrupt-free country which will create freedom to all people and to, the, to utilize the government properties. My ideal world is to have everybody owning a car like this one. My ideal world is to be, from, to be free from diseases. My ideal world is political stability in a country so that to create peace and unity to the people of the world. I would like my ideal world to be the one with good communication and transport network worldwide. I want to live in the, the world free from who? Was. I would like the world to be with the peace and religious way of living. My ideal world is the one which, which is full of integrity, love, peace and compassion and also the one which has storage building. Thank you. My ideal world is a world of creativity because of the increasing population whereby all of us we can afford to live high standards of living. Thank you. Hi, my name is Habiba Muse, and in my ideal world, I would like people to accept everybody for who he or she is. People would be kind and courageous and caring, and there would be no hatred or selfishness or all the bad things that you find in people. I am on a patience. In my idea of the world, I want a world with peace. With peace. In my ideal world, I want a world without without wars. I want a world. I want a world with beautiful schools like PMM Girls School. Thank you. I would like my ideal world everywhere to be developed and no no wars. I would like my other world to be a peaceful country whereby there is no corruption. I would like my other world to be a God-fearing country where there is no, where there is no devotion. My ideal world, I like our country that people should be treated equally, i.e. men, women should be treated equally by men so that they can promote peace and unity. Thank you. In my ideal world, I would like a peaceful world without wars. In my dear world, I would like a developed world without corruption. I, I want the country to be, the world to be with cooperative people, whereby people they have to work with, with people who are hardworking and and in and the working group. I, want, I would like my ideal world to be like a beautiful decent and no gender bias world. Personally, I want my world to be wonderful. One, it will be full of justice, passionate, no anti-stimating others, and thanks for listening. Welcome back from Uganda, and now let's get back from USA. I hope you enjoyed one, the very first one from USA. And now let us look at yet another school in the USA, and, th and that is Brittany Middle Woods High School. Please enjoy as they also show us their views of their ideal world. Um, to be, I want to have like peace and stuff, and I imagine it to be sunny and stuff, and and a good weather. A perfect world is when 
everything is blue and there's no hunger or violence and everyone is happy and me and, and being the only child i have no little kids that's way though uh now going to school um freedom of speech <laughs> yeah um and sunny and you have gained no gun violence welcome back from the usa video and now let's look at yet another school in usa and that is point on high school let us see what they have for their view of their ID world. enjoy so raver what's your idea of a perfect world my idea of a perfect world where well perfect utopia would is kind of simple but yet complicated okay. it's like where uh us, us as, as a species we're united we're in, we live in harmony we live in equality people aren't poor there isn't poverty there's uh we have a universal we have a universal language where people have no more miscommunication there's no more uh racial hatred against each other no more hate crimes against each other it's just it's just like we all live in we all live in peace you know no more wars no more no more no more hunger okay uh is there anything else that you would want in a perfect utopia um no that's pretty much it okay then. thank you all right, so Josh, what's your idea of a perfect world? Perfect world where we end racism, no miscommunication, um, somewhere where an environment where we don't feel less than somebody else, where where we all feel equal, where there's no stress, where there's no poverty, where we we can help each other out, we can we can share ideas, and no one will be wrong nor right just not argue about it and somewhere where no one has to be homeless you know is there anything else um just for everyone to live healthy yeah that's it i'm cole Mukius. i'm from campbell california and uh my ideal world i picture a world with cleaner water for everyone and enough uh, food to go around for the whole wide world. My ideal world peace would be for everybody to not fight over stupid stuff like race and just like gender and stuff, like just so everybody can be chill now and no more wars because that shit like it tears, car it tears apart the country. People are really divided on stuff. No more religion either because that tears apart the country a lot. I don't know, it's just for everybody to be hella chill. Chill with one another, no matter what you are, who you are. Back again in Lesul Alexandru in Romania. Let's watch more of the videos you saw back then. Thank you. I want a world where people are happy and healthy, where is no discrimination of any kid, where a place with understanding and tolerance people who can smile at one another and uh, we can enjoy the beauty of nature. Uh, an ideal world is a world of peace where all children can go to school and all people have uh, uh, have jobs, uh, houses and, uh, and food, uh, where everyone cares about the others. For me, the ideal world is a world without wars, where all people live in peace, a world but all people are equal socially and financially because this is why there are poor people in this world. If we were all equal, the whole world would be happy and the peace will dominate the people. I envision the ideal world would be a world where human rights are respected, there are no wars and everybody lives in harmony. The ideal world would be one in which no child will suffer from hunger, a world in which smile will be on the faces of children and people will be good and understanding in my opinion the ideal world is one in which everyone lives in peace where people love one another a world without discrimination there is a lot of hatred in the world we are living in and i believe this is unacceptable we have the strength but we lack the will of doing something and fixing this atrocious world i don't think we are doomed to live like this forever though i believe there is hope i believe we can change the attitude of the careless and finally bring peace Hope you've had a great time traveling with us through Romania, Pakistan, Australia, USA, India, and Indonesia, and Uganda, and other schools around the world. Thank you for traveling with us. 
Students all over the world have shared with us what they think of their ideal world. Some of them were contradicting, whereas some of them had the same ideas. But still, we could get a picture of what their ideal world would be. We also encourage you, we also encourage you to do the same. Think and envision your ideal world. As we all work together, probably can make our dreams come. Bye! Thank you.